This guy's crazy. Who are we talking about? The guy, the comment guy. The thing that is really annoying me is he's making a lot of assumptions about what we may or may not know about wood. Mm. <laughs> yeah, and, and we know nothing. Power planer? You think that would do, or is that gonna do more damage? You could give her a shot, could right? Try, yeah. Never even been out of the box. Is this in inches? Five yeah, imagine. Two. Let's take off an inch and a half. It's like, <laughs> it just goes jump through the underside. Man, this thing is uh, coming in the clutch. Yeah, it's a godsend. Yeah, we should we should make a video where we're like waxing poetic about how we love the you know the nature of woodworking and the quiet joy we get, and then be like. <laughs> I can't do any of that Michael Jackson stuff. I don't know if uh, we need our mic for this. Yeah, oh. I would say no. Those are the headsets that go to each other. Then we can go to talk while we're doing this. What do you say? If you had a headset, you would know. <laughs> oh, that'd be cool if you had headsets. Yeah. Man, what would you guys have done if you didn't have that machine? <laughs> we would have been screwed. We would have been screwed, brother. Sometimes you you get to a point where you're like, I just have to go buy the tool or whatever. Mm -hmm. I mean, we were, I was prepared to go buy more like belts for the belt yep. sander, just go to town on it. That would, oh. this is record setting day. <clears throat> It'd be funny if like it gets to the point where like we're excited about it, but it almost becomes like a subconscious thing. So like you didn't even break talking then yeah. and you just went <laughs> like that when it happened. We're gonna be like doing like a table side cut. <laughs> <laughs> Just you give a little Kurt Gibson every time. Skipping around the shop. Starting the lawnmower. <laughs> I'm blown away by these these like seemingly surface cracks. I know. Th that's why we taped that one up yeah. so hard. I mean, we taped this one up. Right. This is where we yeah. taped it up all crazy, that's thinking right. like it's gonna come through here. So maybe they just like go and like spread into the yeah. wood, and then it like stops somewhere. It must. It must be like. Like going like yeah. under the surface. I mean, we would know if we cared at all about wood. <laughs> Am I giving this guy too much uh, like credit by bringing the joke up this many times? I don't think he watches these me. videos. He's not on the internet, so. <laughs> <laughs> Even though that's the only way we've interacted with him. What do you think it's happens. gonna look like when it turns the year 10,000? <sighs> Is there gonna be a human being on on this earth. So in 8,000 years from now, yeah. what were we like 8,000 years ago? So in 6,000 BC. Let's, Let's see, what, what was happening 8,000 years ago? What if it just said, eh, not much. Yeah, it was pretty chill. <laughs> <laughs> what was, uh, should I ask? I'm gonna ask. Ooh. Ask Siri. Ask Jeeves. <laughs> <laughs> what was happening 8,000 years ago? 8,200 to 8,000 years ago, 8.2 kilo year event. A sudden decrease of global temperatures. Ancient humans switched from hunter-gatherer mode to agriculture and food production. Oh, wow. They domesticated animals and cultivated cereal grain. The old way where they're just hunting and gathering. I like yeah. that better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah this, guy. <laughs> this guy. I don't yeah. like this newfangled <laughs> agriculture. Jeez, that's a tiny one, too, right there. Just... Hey, the tiny ones are the thirstiest. Yes. Yeah. That's, that's an old epoxy saying. If you but... knew anything about good old days of epoxy pours, you'd know that the tiniest ones are the thirstiest. That's a saying <laughs> from the good old days of epoxy pours. But all that being said, he, I, 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 I respect everything he says. He's being very, very nice about it. And, and I, he's making... You just disagree with his point. I just think it's, he doesn't need to be making the point. It's a point that's like it's so... It's a moot It is point. a moot point. It's like, what's the, what is your point in all moot. of this? Just to, just, it's just to label us something that he values yeah. less than it makes him feel better about himself it, yeah, for totally. us to be wood machinists totally. and not woodworkers and, and, and i'm fine with it <laughs>